Welcome to Frederick Meyer Gardens and Sculpture Park here in Grand Rapids, Michigan. I'm Laurel, a horticulturist in the Lena Meyer Tropical Conservatory. And all year I take care of the plants in this beautiful greenhouse. And every spring I am the butterfly wrangler, which means I take care of the tropical butterflies that live in here in March and April. And today we're gonna to talk about the life cycle of a butterfly. So butterflies go through what is called complete metamorphosis, which means each stage the animal looks completely different, which is really cool and kind of magical. To start with, we're going to talk about courtship, so how the male and female butterflies find each other. Um, and for an example, there's one species of butterfly we have called the postman, and what they do is the female will lay on a leaf, and then a male will come along and he'll flutter against her back like that. And if she likes him, she'll raise her abdomen up. And then they fly off together and mate. Once they mate, the female will oviposit, which means she'll lay her egg on a host plant. And host plants are specific to each kind of butterfly. Kind of think monarchs need milkweed. Each tropical species also has a species of plant that goes with them that their caterpillars will eat. When the butterflies lay their eggs, they're really tiny, and each species' egg looks different. Once a butterfly lays their egg on their host plant, a caterpillar will hatch out. And caterpillars are like little worms, and what they do in this stage of the life cycle is eat. They munch, munch, munch on their host plant. And the very first thing they eat is the egg they just hatch out of. So caterpillars will continue to eat until they get bigger and bigger, and once they're big enough, they will pupate, which means they will go into their chrysalis. And chrysalises are one of my favorite parts of the butterfly life cycle. They all look very different because butterflies are trying to camouflage or hide from predators. So some chrysalids look like leaves, some look like pieces of bark, some look like bird poop, and they're all, what they're trying to do is hide from anything that wants to eat them. And then the next stage of a butterfly is an adult butterfly again. They emerge out of that chrysalis as an adult butterfly. And what the first thing they do is they hang upside down and recirculate their body fluids and get their wings ready to fly. Once their wings are ready to fly, here at the gardens, we gather them up and we release them to fly freely in the conservatory where they can begin that courtship and start the life cycle all over again. So once those butterflies emerge from their chrysalis and they're ready to fly, they become beautiful butterflies and we release them here in our conservatory. Where they start the life cycle all over again.